will tell you guys about my books, my apron, my paintbrushes, my paint, and also the tray arts easel. So let's get into the video and hope you guys enjoy it. For those who don't know me, my name is Treyon. I own a business called Trey Arts. It's an art studio that which I do virtual paint nights, uh, personalized art, and a lot more. But first, let's you now let's get into this and let's see what I got on this table here. So the first thing I'm gonna do, guys, is the aprons. And this is my own brand of apron. If you guys can see, it says Trey Arts, and it says Trey Blazer, and it's. I always like aprons that's not too long. And I don't know if you guys can see this, so this is how the apron looks like. And I actually did the purple trim. I love the purple trim. And I like this solid black apron. And you guys hear that? I like, it's so easy to clean. And that's one thing I love about this apron that if I get anything on it, I can just wipe it out. So, and it's perfect for adults and kids. And this is why I love it. And it comes, this is how it comes. Like, I just didn't want to unpackage this because it's going to be crazy. It's going to be crazy. So, next thing we're going to do is the Trey Arts brushes. And I know a lot of you guys, for those who actually done my paint nights before, and I've been giving you guys all the brushes. So, you have, with these, you have four brushes. And let me tell you guys the backstory about these brushes, actually. When I first ordered these brushes, I wanted a big size like this. But what ended up happening, I got my big size is this. So what I've learned, you have to literally draw out stuff and put dimension correctly because this is what you're gonna get. Okay, so I love these brushes. These brushes are amazing. So it does say Trey Arts on it too, guys. So if you guys actually want these brushes, the link is also in the description. And moving on, towards the paint. I create the Trey Arts paint. And with this, as you guys can see, at the side it has the colors, what is basically inside. I try to put the main, main colors that we need, especially for my paintings, all right? Because again, we do paint these with my paint kits for my virtual paint nights. And you guys have all the colors, as you guys can see, the white, the black, the brown, the burnt sienna, the raw sienna, the green, the yellow, the red. It's a nice, compact paint set. I do use my own paint to paint some of my pieces as well too, so great, a great, great thing to do. And next thing guys, I'm gonna talk to you guys about my easel. And I, like, I think once I got in my easel, I was so pleased with it. And it, it could do, basically this is my two in one easel. And for those who don't know me guys, I love gold. And I'm from Guyana, so gold is a, a thing for us, all right? So it does come with, in this nice durable bag, and it is purple. This durable bag right here, I just, like you could see the material. It's somewhat like the same material with the apron. You know, we don't want, if you do get any paint, dirt, anything on it is easily to wipe out. And we have a little strap here. You could adjust the strap right here. And of course, we have to put our logo on it. Let's, let me open this up and show you guys what is inside because this is, once I guess I want to see this, I was actually gonna make it purple, but I'm like, you know what? Let me change it around. Let me open this bag. Then we'll just toss this to the side here. So this is, the gold easel. So I actually have one right here. So this is the easel. And we have these little knobs right here. Once you open it, the easel extends. And you just close it, you lock it back. You lock it back. Let me just open this. It's very, and this is like I said, you go lock. Once you turn this knob, it locks the easel. So, and you guys see this knob right here, this winder, I should call it. You just turn it and turn it. And that is the height of basically of your canvas. As you guys could see, this is where you rest the canvas, right? 
and this is the knob I'm telling you guys about. But if you guys don't want it to be fully adjusted, you have a leveler right on top here to show, show you if it's level or not. You're painting outside, you just wanna rest your tray arts bag on the floor, you just hang it just like that. And again, you open, you open these areas, these clips, you close it once you are putting it up, open again, push up, lock. I've talked to you guys about my aprons, my paintbrushes, my paint, and my easel. So something that what I'm also proud of, guys, are also my coloring books. So I'm gonna actually show you guys what my coloring book is. So I'm gonna show you guys my first one that I actually created and which is called Freaky Art. The title speaks for itself, all right? So I'm just gonna show you guys one piece that's, I want YouTube to get mad at me, you know? So this is one piece, as you guys see, there's a, this is actually my original painting and I've came up with a storyline of this painting and on the right hand side, you will have your stencil where you could color. I love the quality of this book. So this is my Freaky Art color book. You guys have the little um, description of what this book is and it says what's best for it to be used with. And now I have just created, guys, my, my other Trey Arts coloring book, but it's called The Coloring Book. So this is, there they are right now. This is volume one and volume two. So this is the volume one cover. As you guys could see, some of my art is, I did design my own coloring book, guys, and it was work, but I love designing anything that's for my brand or for me. So as you guys could see, I have to have the goal there. I have to. And most of my paintings that's in it, you guys could see a little preview of the art. And if you turn on the back, somewhat the same thing as well. All right, the brief description of the book. Let's open this book. I'm not gonna show you guys all the pages, but this is something you guys can have fun coloring. And you write your name here. And look at this. Like you guys could hear the quality of the paper. It's a thick paper and I love it. And this is the stencil, this is the painting. This is the edition one, as you guys see, volume one, the coloring book, Tra Trailblazers edition. This is the stencil. You just follow exactly what you see here. You guys could create it yourself. Just because it's black and white, that doesn't mean you have to do it black and white. So you guys could get the volume one if you like. Perfect for kids, perfect for adults, just anyone. This book is amazing. It's a great thing to have, guys. and. It was, a, it was a great book. So that's for Freaky Art and the Coloring Book Volume 1. The Coloring Book Volume 2. As you guys see, this one is different. It's in all black. I still keep the same layout. I do want the books to be the same. You guys see the front and the back is the same layout. So right here now, guys, you guys see, same thing I did, but as you could see, the painting is faded into the background of the book. As you guys could see, you guys could see some painting, and this is rated E for everyone. <laughs> and this is the volume two, all right? Same thing, like I said, let me move this apron out of the way. As you guys see, I kept the same layout. I want the book to be the same. I want you guys to know it. Like, hey, this is a collection piece. So you guys have the volume one, and you have the volume two. Everything is basically the same. What's different is the covers and what is inside of the book. All right, so let's push that away. Let's open this bad boy up. Ta-da! This is the piece, guys, I've done like almost a decade ago, and it's basically a heart. Okay, and some people say they could see a face. I just pin in a heart. It's more like a um, energy type of stuff that I did about 10 years ago. And something, let me show you this one for sure, because a lot of people like pop smoke so I this is what I done for a paint night before guys and this is like again you guys see the quality of this paper it's quality you guys can see look at this page look how it shines 
quality. This is, I always say, quality over quantity. This is one of it. And for the kids, we, ha we had to do it. You know, Wakanda forever. Yeah, so guys, so that's, um, that's it on volume two and volume one. Both amazing books. And also for the adults, freaky art, coloring book. So, um, I, like I said, I'll put a link in the description where you can purchase all these products. And if there's anything you guys want me to comment on or go in more in depth on, or you guys see any of my paintings that you guys want me to kind of explain, or if you guys just want me to paint something and put it up on this channel, just please put a link in, um, put whatever you guys want to paint in the comment box. And I'm gonna actually go and start doing some painting with my easel, my brushes, and my paints. This, that sounds so amazing. So if you guys haven't followed me as yet, uh, follow me on Instagram, Trey Arts. It's T-R-A-Y-A-R-T-S. For some reason, people spell Trey as T-R-E. It's okay, and guy, know we call that tree, but it's okay. Um, if you guys haven't liked and subscribed to the page, do so now and turn on the notification bell so you guys can be notified whenever I upload a new video because I'm trying to do this a lot more, guys. Show you guys what I do, show you guys behind the scenes of what, what I do and also for my paint rights. All right, so uh, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate all you guys. Stay safe. And remember, invest in yourself, invest in your brand, invest in your business, okay? Because it's a win-win, all right? So again, all these products here, link is in the description. And thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you guys like it so I can make more video and comment. And yeah, take care, guys. I love you guys. Remember, be yourself and love yourself. Uh.